Google Alert, so you know what that means. The very first thing I love, it's an app. I remember using it two years ago, but then I switched my phone and I just couldn't remember the name of it and I couldn't use the phone because it was completely broken. So I spent months looking for it and I just could remember that it was about planets and stars. So I kept going and looking for like best apps about planets and I just couldn't find it. I was just about to give up when I thought, why not to just put the easiest name out there? planets so i did i searched for it and it was the first suggestion it was right there so i began using it every single night and it's just so much fun it locates where you are and from there it displays the skies as you see it so you can tell what you're looking at the cool thing about this is that it also has some extra features so for example if you want to know more about the planets you can click on them or you can make them spin and it's just so amazing the second thing is a food favorite, but for the first time ever, I believe it's actually healthy. Before I tell you what it is, I just want to say that I come from Italy and in Italy we never eat these things. So it might be very common for you, like you might think that it's not new, but to me it is, so I'm going to share it anyway. Hopefully you won't kill me for it. Can you guess what it is? It's orange. Yeah. A month ago I was traveling back to Italy In the plane they were giving out porridge and I tasted it and I realized how much I loved it So when I got back here I went to the grocery store and I found porridge A lot of it So I pretty much tried every single brand out there that make the easy porridge where you just add the water And I finally found my favorite one which is the Oat So Simple They just make it in so many different flavors My favorite is the vanilla and honey just so delicious but even the caramel and all the others are just so good I love it the next two favorites are both Asian products the first one is something that I have been using almost every single time I do my makeup and it's this BB cream it's called aqua Pitti jelly and the consistency as the name says is so unique because it's pretty much jelly but the super cool thing about it is that it's super lightweight so when you apply it it doesn't even feel like you're wearing makeup and the coverage is not the highest but it looks very natural so that's really good and the second product is this hand cream from the brand It's Skin and it looks absolutely adorable and I've got sent this from a subscriber she actually owns this really cute Asian store online so if you want to check her out and see what she sells you should go for it and then leave the link down there but she actually sent me two of these hand cream in my opinion the pink one smells like candy but not like an overwhelming smell of candy it's just a very nice one and the other one is your typical citrusy scent which is very nice as well and now the very last favorite for this month is a book it's called From Bad to Cursed and it's from Katie Allender and it's part of a trilogy I read the first one last month which I really really enjoyed so I went on and read this one this month and I have to say that the other one was a bit better in my opinion maybe because I didn't know exactly what to expect but in any case the storyline of this one is very intriguing as well and I really can't wait to read the last one and to give you just a tiny bit of an idea of what the book is about I'm gonna read the back, just the first sentence. It says, Alexis is the last girl you would expect to sell her soul. She already has everything she needs. An adorable boyfriend, the perfect best friend, and a little sister who is finally recovering after being possessed by an evil spirit. So yeah, you get the point, right? It's pretty cool. So these were all my favorites. As you might have noticed, I didn't put any movies or music because I didn't really find anything that stood out to me the last month. But if you have any suggestions, I would love to read them. And as always, this is it for today. And put it on water. But yeah, I'm gonna go. I hope you enjoy it and I will see you very soon. Bye!